Hey guys, what's up? So, you guys... Um, sorry guys, I will... So, guys, um, many of you posted um, comments on my previous video on how to dual boot CM10 and stock ROM on this phone, the Droid Razor. And yeah, um, you have to add uh, small issues. Some of you got dual, um, got boot loops on CM10. And yeah, some of you had uh, crashes in the Play Store, for example. Um, it worked for you when you um, haven't installed G apps. Yes, yeah, some of you got it work um, proper, proper, properly. And yeah, I will now a uh, safe strap version 3 is out. It's based on Team Win Recovery Project. So you are able to boot f up to five ROMs, I guess, including the stock ROM. So safe strap is very stable now. And let's install it. And hopefully everything works for you. And I give you a guarantee. 99% it will work flawless and you won't get a boot loop or something else. So let's get to it. So guys, um, now we are on the phone. So let's do some preparations here. Um, yeah, before you do um, uh, install safe strap recovery, you have to make sure that you, uh, when you're using Project Lens Boot Menu Manager, you have to um, get rid of all these um, packages here. Let's get to the installer and you see that every box here is checked. So before you um, install SafeStrap Recovery, make sure that you uninstall Hijack. Yeah, that's done. So now you have to uninstall packages and uninstall um, Boot Menu Manager. Yeah. So uninstall is finished. Sorry guys, um, yeah, let's move on. Um, now you can see that I'm actually downloading the latest uh, nightly available for the Razer CM10 version, um, October 18, so that's today actually. So that's very cool. And I will give you, of course, all the links in the description. So first you have to download a uh, safe strap the APK version 3 um, after you uninstalled all these boot menu things go to your explorer and go to your download directory when you downloaded it there so safe strap ICS uh, version 3.0.4 so make sure your phone is running latest um, ICS build official of course this is a stock ROM so yeah install safe strap ICS a recovery install. Why the hell is actually a... Uh, yeah, uh, that's <laughs> that's not so important. But um, yeah, so let's open the recovery um, installer. So when you get this request, just hit allow. So your phone also has to be rooted, but <laughs> I think when you subscribe to my channel, your phone is probably rooted. So that's very easy now. Just um, hit install recovery. This is proper. Yeah, running installation group, cleaning up. Yeah, so that's um, done now. Uh, yeah, I will give you now the list of the files you have to download. That's very easy. Just download the latest G-Apps Jelly Bean from the 11th Oct of October and your favorite build. Um, maybe it's AOKP or CM10. I just... Um, I choose... Yeah, it's actually ready. Um, the CM10 build here, October 18. So just the CM10 and G-Apps or AOKP and G-Apps, the latest. This is now running um, CM10 4.1.2 when it's done. So recovery is installed and yeah. Gangnam Style. So um, yeah, let's move on now. 
Um, so when you installed the um, safe job recovery, you just have to reboot. And yeah, so this phone has actually the option in the boot menu and uh, the power menu. But yeah, let's power up the phone. And wait till you see a, a splash screen. And when you see it, just tap the menu button. So you enter the recovery very fast. Let's see if this works. Oh, you see me behind the camera. Oh no, that was not so smart. <laughs> Just get rid of this one here. So just wait until you see the splash screen. Now it's there. So hit menu for recovery or you can also hit search when you want to go to your stock system. And yeah, this will boot up the custom recovery. So now you see it guys. Um, now you can actually plug in your charger cable because this um, uh, recovery is based on Team Win Recovery Project, the, yeah, it's very, yeah, almost the latest build. But you can now charge your phone in recovery, that's a really neat feature. I think Boot Menu also got this option, but I'm not so sure. Now you can go to, let's see actually what these features are here. So these are these ROM slots, as I told you in the beginning. You got uh, four ROM slots for custom ROMs and your stock ROM. So this recovery won't touch your stock ROM when you install CM10, for example, and just leave it there. Now let's go to ROM slot one. Yeah, you now you can actually um, system partition size. So when you go... Um, less than one gigabyte you have for example more rom space available and you get more rom slots when you choose three gigabytes you only have two rom slots or something let's choose one gigabyte and yeah this is a system partition size you can't mess with that but you don't need to and also the cache partition size is fixed get your free space here 3.6 gigabytes. So let's create a new ROM slot, number one. This is now creating a ROM slot. This will take a while. I think 20 seconds or something. Let's wait. Why would someone dislike this video? 25,000 negative votes. Hmm. So, guys, um, ROM slot 1 is finished, so yeah, we just created our new ROM slot. Let's activate it. Oh, you can also set a nickname, so let's do this here. Oh, now you can get the nice keyboard also in recovery. Let's choose simply, simply, simple name here, CM10. Yeah, go. Now it's called CM10, let's activate it. Yeah, CM10. So it's activated and now we can in yeah, 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 wipe. ROM slot 1 is activated, so when you wipe it's only on ROM slot 1, so your stock system isn't actually touched whatsoever. So let's do a factory reset, wipe, yeah, factory reset. 
Let's uh, wipe Davi Cash here. So swipe to wipe. It's really cool. The team win recovery project is also on my Galaxy Nexus. Really cool. Um, yeah. This is done now. Let's um, install. So now you go to your partition where you actually start your files. Let's go to our latest nightly of CM10. Yeah, it's located here. Yeah, you can also verify your zip file signature, but we won't do that here. So you can add more zips. So let's actually choose... Oh no, that's not so good. Go to our um, ROM stuff partition. There I have my my Jelly Bean apps, G apps. Oh no, oh no. Let's clear the... So <laughs> let's do it again, guys. Um, sorry for that little fail here. So the ROM, one of maximum 10, max 10. Add more zip, go up a level and go to ROM stuff. Choose the Jelly Bean G apps latest. And yeah, now we have it. Let's swipe to confirm and install all these nice things here. Flashing file one of two. Starting the installation. Oh, I'm very curious about that and really amazing that now safe strip is ready. And guys, um, just um, share your experience with that recovery in my comment section below the video would be awesome. We should help each other and share our experiences. And I hope this will work flawless for you because you had several bugs with my previous uh, method tutorial video and would be awesome if you share your experience. Flashing file one of two, this will take a while. Now we, um, it's um, on flash file two of two. So Jellybean J apps are almost ready here. Installation complete it says. Yeah, nice. Um, let's reboot system. So ROM slot one is activated, so it will reboot <laughs> our system to CM10. Let's get rid of this here. Gangnam Style. So let's skip the recovery here with our magnifying glass search button. Hopefully, please work. Yeah, this looks good, guys. Um, CM10 boot animation. I'm with you in a video. Wow, this looks cool. Android 4.1.2, you saw this um, first hint. This boots up this really nice guys. Please install safe strap and do everything in the video here. Which I told you would be awesome. You have a stock system and yeah. I'm so high on Android now. Um buy yourself get yourself an external SD card. I will do that also. But I um no I don't have the money. I will get some money soon and will buy some. And not some, but one SD card, micro SD card. And yeah, because this form, um, this um, recovery project uses your internal SD for only ROMs and it will not allow to install some apps on, on this petition. You will have to get an extra. Let's skip all this here. Yeah, Google location. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I hate this when I first install a ROM. So finish. Yeah, it works. Nice. So just for confirmation, 4.1.2. CM10, guys. 
so guys have a great day um for me it's really nice weather now and i hope you enjoy your new um cm10 rom let's go to our home screen and guys stay subscribed um leave a comment and like the video and subscribe if you haven't done it already so guys have a great week no it's actually <laughs> have a great day